Welcome to our daily devotional series, The Daily Herald. I pray that these messages will come to you as an encouragement and a reminder to be heralds of the Lord daily. God bless you. Laborers to shine as the stars. October 31. Promises and rewards. And they that be wise shall shine as the brightness of the firmament. And they that turn many to righteousness as the stars forever and ever. Daniel 12.3 What we shall be in heaven is the reflection of what we are now in character and holy service. Christ said of himself, The Son of Man came not to be ministered unto, but to minister. This his work on earth is his work in heaven. And our reward for working with Christ in this world is the greater power and wider privilege of working with Him in the world to come. How many toil unselfishly and unweariedly for those who pass beyond their reach and knowledge. Parents and teachers lie down in their last sleep, their life work seeming to have been wrought in vain. They know not that their faithfulness has unsealed springs of blessing that can never cease to flow. Only by faith they see the children they have trained become a benediction and an inspiration to their fellow men, and the influence repeat itself a thousandfold. Many a worker sends out into the world messages of strength and hope and courage, words that carry blessing to hearts in every land, but of the results he, toiling in lowliness and obscurity, knows little. So gifts are bestowed, burdens are borne, labor is done. Men sowed the seed from which, above their graves, others reap blessed harvests, in the hereafter, the action and reaction of all these will be seen. Of every gift that God has bestowed, leading men to unselfish effort, a record is kept in heaven. To trace this in its wide-spreading lines, to look upon those who by our efforts have been uplifted and ennobled, this will be one of the studies and rewards of the heavenly school.